It's time now to join my guest, Adrian Lacey. Now, Adrian is a local author from Chesham. Good evening, Adrian. Welcome to Children's Voice. Good evening. It's lovely to be here. Now, you've uh, recently written a book, but tell us a little bit first about um, a little bit about your writing and uh, what you're doing. Um, well, primarily, I'm a sort of photographer, basically. Um, the book was a concept that came along to try and sort of bring out there the positives of life to people um, and share my adventures that I've had through life. Um, I've also helped a family member, my mum, um, who's done children's books, and I've tried to help turn them into finished articles. Um, so I kind of started with the children's books and then thought I needed to do something myself and something that was positive and would bring a cheer to the community. Now, you have a new book out. It's called A Little Piece of Me, and you very kindly uh, brought a couple of copies into the Children's Voice studio. Tell us a little bit about this book. Um, this book is basically a few of my adventures, literally from everything from going to Brownsea Island and seeing red squirrels to um, Comic Con, where I've um, there's actually some comments made by three actresses within the book um, when I've been to Comic Cons, and days out where you see nice flowers, and basically things that are personal to me that I'm trying to share with everyone else to say, Look, this is a nice day out I had. Um, and try and trigger memories in other people so they can think of other happy memories they've had. Now, you mentioned there that you were a photographer. Um, I noticed actually in the book there's a number of absolutely fantastic photos. Did you take an awful lot of these photos? Yes, they are basically all my photo photos. Obviously, the ones that feature me in them, it would have been a family member that would have taken them. Um, but basically, it's it's my photography. And it's just, I'm, I say I'm a photographer, I just take pictures for fun. Like, like a lot of people out there, that you know, you'd go out on a day out, you'd take your camera with you, and uh, but I just enjoy taking my camera and taking pictures of things. Now, obviously, the, the book is entitled "A Little Piece of um, Me," and it says, "On a dark side, seek the light, the positives of life." So, tell me a little bit more about that particular story, which is shown through the book. Um, it was basically that. There's so much bad things that happen in the world, and, and that's a, a lot for our own perspectives, just simple day-to-day -day ups and downs, through to bigger things that we've had. Obviously, we had lockdown and everything, um, but also just the basic ups and downs everyone has through day-to-day -day life. And, well, I think the, the actual aim of the book page sums it up, and I've put, the world can be a dark place at times for many, and we hear so much of the dull, dismal and sad side of life. I hope this book shows you just a tiny snapshot of the beauty, colour and positivity this world uh, this has to offer from some of my adventures. I also noticed in here, in about uh, page uh, 12, you've got uh, three pictures there where you are with um, people who endorsed your book. Tell me a little bit about that page and those people. Um, that's when I've been to Comic-Con and uh, there's a number of actresses that, I, that I've seen when I'm at Comic-Con and these three really have been a, a help and a positive motivation for me. Um, with my mum's books where they've done forwards and everything, one of them is Katie Manning. She was a Doctor Who actress during the John Pertwee years. She was the assistant to the Doctor. Um, and she's written what, well, it's from my point of view, it's a tear-jerking comment. Um, did you want me to read that quickly? Yes, yeah. certainly, yes. Yeah. Uh, it was such a joy meeting Adrian, a young man who is so positive and driven in everything he does. In life and on social media, he's a real ray of adventuring sunshine and never stops being creative. He is also a wonderful support to his very talented mother in her music, excellent children's books and poetry. Last but no means least, he really knows his tea. Thank you, Adrian, for all your years of support and friendship. Katie Manning. That is a very, very nice piece. And you're obviously a very big tea drinker as well. Oh, yes. Any 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 blends, I, I just enjoy trying whatever tea is available. <laughs> right, now you're going to be at the um, Chapter 2 bookshop. Tell us about that. Yes, I'm doing a meet and greet at Chapter 2. Um, it's in a, about a couple of weeks' time. Um, it's on the 11th, uh, sorry, Saturday the 17th of February. Um, they have a community table in there, so from 11 o'clock in the morning on that Saturday 17th of February, I will, be, uh, I will be there to be able to talk about my book, but also I would really love just to hear people's positive day out stories. If they want to come along and just say, I've looked at your book and I've seen this page and 
you know, I had a similar day out. You know, I'd, I'd love to hear what people think. Now, it's the most important thing about a, a book is to be able to uh, sell the copies. Where can people get a copy of the book from? OK, people that are local um, know the High Street. The Good Earth Gallery, um, is, it's available down there in Lacey's Yard. Um, also, I have a website, which is actually my name. So it's www.adrianlacey.co.uk. Um, and you'll see my mum's children's books there as well as this book. And there is actually a link to buy on eBay and it can be posted to you and it's direct from me and I will sign it, sign it for people as well. Adrian, that's absolutely fantastic. Well, thank you very much for coming. And uh, let's just remind uh, our listener that you're going to be at Chapter 2. That's on Saturday, the 17th of February. What sort of time are you down there from? From 11 o'clock in the morning. It's, it's morning, but I'll, I'll be there as long as, uh, long as I can. Yeah. As long as people keep streaming through the door, as they say. And hearing those lovely, positive adventures. Yeah. Adrian, thank you very much. Now, you chose a song when you came in here. Which song did you choose? I chose the final countdown. It's one that seems the song that's following me around that I really love. So I thought, yeah, if we can get that on, that'd be good. Adrian Lacey, thank you very much for coming in. Thank you for having me.